Uh, this is CS Trades 101, the Wolf Pack. How's everybody doing tonight? Uh, it's late at night um, because I came across some information um, from the SEC. These documents that uh, haven't even been, um, they're, they're just official, they haven't even been uh, proposed on yet. They're just, they're fresh, ready to go. Okay, um, these will be, uh, like I said, they're just released today, like seven hours ago. These will um, be going um, out. Okay, these are going to be. This already been talked about um, in a board meeting. So the, all this stuff is a proposal. Um, I just want to be very clear on that. There's a lot of speculation going around, and I just wanted to get this out there before um, there's a wrong spin on this stuff. As we know that this stuff gets spun really good, and um, I just want to be very clear that this is the actual official document, and you can you can back check this stuff. Um, probably in a day or two, it'll be public knowledge. They have to propose this. Um, this is in the Security Act of 1934. I've explained before, a lot of these rules are old. Um, that's the problem with all the synthetics and all this um, new digital stuff, okay? They're slowly changing it. <clears throat> so, anyways, if you want to check, it's a Form 8K, okay? It's a, it's a, what is this, stock split slash, there's two proposals in here. A stock, actually three, I'll, I'll get into that. It's a, it's a proposal for, um, and that's what the share, there'll be a vote, a look, uh, there'll be a digital electronic vote um, most likely, or if you're close to it, you can go vote in person. Usually they give you that opportunity. I've been through a substantial amount of these. Um, they have to, um, they have to do a share. Uh, there'll be a count too. Also, what it will be is a purge. Um, they'll, whatever, um, synthetics come in, they will get rid of them. Okay. So, um, what it will do is they, um, Cupid numbers, they put, um, they register them. They're all going to be registered with, um, federal documentation added to them. Um, because there's going to be taxes claimed on and exemptions if you had them for a year it depends on either way you go so the company will be filing their uh quarterlies and yearlies and um you'll be filing your yearlies if if that's what you do most people do that <clears throat> okay so you can um they'll want taxes the government on this stuff or you can claim against if you help it. you can get a tax break it depends on where you live and, and what country too there's a lot of stuff but the tax stuff i'm not getting into too much here i'm just going to get into these docket numbers um, to help you guys out to get the correct information okay so as you know this stuff is not signed yet it's blank because it is it, it hasn't gone to that far yet okay all this stuff will be signed up when you receive it in your docket or online docket form okay so <clears throat> this was just proposed today as you can see that the earliest date it can be today um, there's a commission file number uh, file number one dash three two six three seven Okay, it's official for IRS employee ID number. That's what I said. It's a, it's a federal document now. The, um, they're, they're, they had to meet a bunch of criteria to get into this. It's it's pretty tricky, actually. They got to meet. It's pretty tough regulations, but they met them, or else they wouldn't be this far yet. So now it's up to you guys, the shareholders, to, to go through this. I'm pretty sure that you guys. Um, I don't own any GME. I'm just doing this because um, that's what uh, we do. Um, is try to get that correct information out. Um, just because um, it's not good for speculation to go around about this stuff. Um, when you can get when we uh, somebody has access to the real stuff, um, especially in our group that I deal with, um, that's what we're trying to do is be very very open with people and try to squash a lot of the speculation stuff. It just hurts people. There's no good that can come out of it. So um, there's a whole bunch of uh, rulings right here. You can check all that stuff out. A lot of these are older. Like I said, um, the initial one was from 1934. So what I'll get into is some stuff here. I'm not going to get into all this exchange stuff because that's just basic stuff that. Um, some uh, rules that you, that you have to abide by. So the item number is zero, uh, eight zero eight decimal zero one. Um, it's other events on March thirty first two thousand twenty. GameStop Corp um, announced it is planned to request a sh uh, stockholders approval. So that would be you guys. Um, uh, annual meeting stockholder, right? That's what they're going to call. Uh, Common name shares. Um, it's going to go through three hundred million to one billion stock split. Okay, I'm just talking about this fast because I like to keep my podcast short. Okay, I, I just know you guys are busy and I feel the same way. I don't like podcasts that go on forever. I just, I just don't. I don't like the, that style stuff. So um, anyways, they're going to, they want to do a stock split. So we covered that. They do have, uh, they're going to squash these 800 share, uh, eight, sorry, they're going to squash these, these 8 uh, million shares, uh, which common are A, they're going to replace them. That was a proposal in 2019. They got a new proposal to offer, which the, the, uh, but the stock dividend will um, contribute to the final board approval. So they're going to replace it with um, with dividend, okay? Um, and the, the national numbers of the dividend royalty, um, which is a technical name for it, um, that's the money that they're going to be disclosing for the amount that you invest, okay? It goes off of what the company makes. 
Um, that's the only way it goes, okay? So if the company does good in that physical year, they will um, break up the dividend into quarters, most likely with this company, um, just the way it looks so far. Um, I don't have the actual document, they're not even out yet. So um, the company will have to report on a form 10K for the physical year, okay? And that was that's supposed to be done on January 29th, 2022. Uh, which would um yes which was already done okay and if you want to go check all that stuff out uh, the sac they have to legally keep uh this information especially when it's a dividend play so what this will do it's it's a purge okay they're going to purge it they're going to call back um it's purged to get all the synthetics out so um that's just what happens with when you enter into dividend um, play um so what will happen um it only goes this one way Okay, they're gonna call the shares in. They're gonna put Cupid numbers on them, okay? Um, the original ones do. We're talking about the, sh the synthetics, are they're invisible. They're just gonna push them aside. They'll keep count of them. They'll propose them to DTC. They'll deal with them. They'll get squashed and just dealt with them, okay? So who cares about that? It doesn't mean anything, okay? So the physical stuff, what the, we wanna talk about the factual information, okay? What they're gonna do is register these stuff with a federal lot number on them um, for the um, IRS um, because the taxes have to be paid on them. It's, the government will want their money for this stuff. So the company is, is obligated to disclose to the government uh, a form stating that this person owns it, this, and they keep track of everything. Okay, it's tied into your guys' uh, bank with brokers with your social insurance, or, or you guys don't call it social insurance number, but um, we do up in Canada. Same thing, your, um, your uh, what is it, government number, okay, for taxes. And you will be obligated to, um, to, or to, um, to disclose to them um, once a year um, to how many you own and um, through your broker will send you the forms so um, just make sure you file that stuff you don't want to get in the rears on this stuff because the IRS will come after you this is serious stuff um, and it's a federal um, it's a federal um, indictment okay um, over a certain amount of time so I just wanted to say that um, and I'm gonna go through some other stuff date of March here's the date so this is the person it's not it hasn't been officially signed off but you can go check out some more information at www.gamestop.com um trading some gme number of exchange csa okay they didn't uh emergency growth i'm just to make sure i cover the cake uh, eight cup yeah that's is it so i just wanted to be um i just wanted to show you this um stuff um and you can go check these um numbers out it's good to at least look at this type of stuff once just to educate yourself on this um it's very interesting stuff the, the rulings are a little bit dry but there's a, there's a lot of good powerful information in there um it's good to educate yourself on this stuff and i've given you um the basic route to expand out from there okay we'll pack you have a great day enjoy the content peace